Welcome to the Old Timer Centre. My name is Philip Tarrant and I'll be talking to you about this 2006 BMW 118. Although it's called a 118i, it does have the 2 litre four cylinder engine. It's black in colour with cream leather interior and it's a six speed manual. It's got a very good service history to it. It's got the two original remote keys and for a car of 155,000 kilometres it's in excellent condition. Although it's a two litre BMW engine, it is a four cylinder. They went from the two litre six cylinder to the four cylinder because they realised that uh, although the two litre six sounded fantastic, they were pretty gutless unfortunately. In a two litre, you're much better off having a four cylinder. As I said, it's, it's in particularly good condition. It's got these BMW blinds in the back, which don't retract, but you can, they can, you can pull them in and out. It's got the very nice five-spoke alloy wheels. And I think it's incredible value for money. With these cars, it's not necessarily about the Ks. It's how they've been looked after. You can find one with 80,000 kilometres, which has probably had three or four services in its entire life. Or you can find a car like this, which has been serviced very well all the way through right up until now. And it just had $1,500 spent on some shock absorbers and bits and pieces, so it doesn't require anything. The back seats fold down. It's got no number plates on it because it was traded from Canberra. And I do find we get some great cars out of Canberra. I'm not sure if it's because they don't have bumper-to-bumper -bumper traffic like we do in Sydney. Or because it's maybe a bit bit cooler they don't get sun damage like they do from say cars in Queensland I'm not sure but we've had great experience with cars we're buying from Canberra and this was traded in on a much later model European car um, it is a six-speed not a five-speed manual the air conditioning is ice cold it doesn't have a sunroof which I think is a good thing when they get to this age generally you'd find the drain holes have clogged up and uh, you can get some water in the cabin. The headlights are nice and clear. It has been garaged. It's just come into us. We've literally just given it a wash with soap and water. It hasn't even been detailed and it's, it's come up beautifully. So if you're looking for a good value car for under $10,000, I mean, it's great that it's a manual. They're getting harder and harder to find. Everything seems to be automatic these days. It's very economical, reliable. The engine's nice and smooth. When you take the oil cap off, it's nice and clean. I say that because for some reason a lot of BMWs go a long way between servicing. And uh, yeah, it's just not good for the engines. You can generally tell when you take the oil cap off. It's either filthy, black, and almost looks like carbon. Or it's someone's wiped Vegemite over the oil cap. Or it looks nice and clean like this car. But it's very impressive. And normally something of this age with 155,000 kilometres in a two litre four cylinder. We'd, we'd usually wholesale or send to auction, but this was such a good car. We've, uh, we've retailed it. And as I said, I don't think it's gonna last very long at this price. Thanks so much for taking the time to watch this video. We can help you out with finance. We're 15 to 20 minutes from Sydney airport. And I'd certainly welcome the opportunity to take you for a test drive.